That's about the end of the relationship. It was evening. The room flooded with misery light. Our faces pinched with the final words we wished to say to each other, our jaws wired shut into silence. My hand shook so in the brown air that the cupboard door slammed like a fired cannon. I could not look upon your face, folded in on itself, an origami of anger, when it was the same face that once beheld me in wonder. It seemed as if I heard again my mother's voice. I should have married him instead of you. From the room at the end of the hall, and my father speechless with his own thoughts of murder. Now we could not even think. You were sunk deep in the blue chair, blinking at television, while in the silence a distant hum took hold, a sound I thought only the electric wire buzz of bottled rage. But it was an airplane flying low between the office buildings and condominiums all around us. Not turning to me, you stretched out your arm to point at its size, its spanning wings, its belly bright as a bullet. Look, you said, did you see that? As though we were two lovers parked in the airfield, interrupted in our embraces by the miracle of flight. <laughs>